we're not happy with the issues that our competitor is having. Um, I think it's not helpful for the, for the industry, and uh, if it's not helpful for the industry, it's not helpful for Airbus. We do think that we have very good products, and we have seen this in the very good order intake uh, that we've seen in 2023, and that is simply continuing also in 2024. Of course, there's huge demand. There is a capacity crunch out there. Airlines want more and more planes. Uh, there is a concern out there that that's what is putting pressure on the plane manufacturers, that there's a need of speed and that sometimes quality control is kind of the collateral um, victim of this. Um, so are you concerned that what we've seen again at your competitor is kind of damaging the trust that there is in the aerospace industry in a wider way? Well, the way I would look at it is uh, we, we look at this and we see that for us it's a um, factor that makes us even think more, how can we make sure that these things will never happen at Airbus? We're obsessed by the thought and therefore we have put even more scrutiny in terms of our production processes. We have even uh, put more emphasis on the long-term investments that we're making in terms of products but also technology. And I think that has made, served us very well in the past and we're continuing exactly along this path. You're working with the um, aero system as a supplier. Um, Boeing, according to some reports, is considering buying it back. Of course, it is supplying to you as well. So I want to ask you, what would be the impact for Airbus if this uh, acquisition was happening? Yeah. We're talking about Spirit as a yes. supplier. Uh, they are producing also important uh, work packages for Airbus, namely the wings for our 220 model and also one section for the 350. So it's very important for us that we have a stable relationship with Spirit. So already over the last number of months, we've worked with them operationally to support uh, their performance. But of course, in light of the situation today, where Boeing has potentially the interest to take over Spirit, we could also imagine that some of the work packages could be again uh, find their way to Airbus and we take them over. But that, quite frankly, is a discussion in very, very early stages, and it's way too early to make a comment on that. Very finally on this topic, uh, Bruno Le Maire, the French economy and finance minister, said a couple of days ago that he would feel more comfortable flying on an Airbus plane than a Boeing one because of safety. What do you make of these comments? Well, I think Guillaume said uh, the right thing, which is um, we're not happy with what is happening to our competitors because it puts doubt on the industry and that is not good. So for us, um, we want to be very humble. It reminds us that safety um, is really the entire foundation that this industry is built on and therefore we're doubling up on the efforts that we're making um, and we're making sure that uh, we do everything to avoid exactly these mishaps.